Yes, you know, chicken soup and hot tea. You know, those are those are the those are the natural cures. All right. Well, we are tracking air quality. We're tracking thunderstorms for later. So two big headlines in the weather today and lots of alerts across the country. So of course the air quality alerts is what we're talking about here and regionally in general because of the wildfires in Canada. And then on top of that, numerous heat alerts continue to the Southwest. I mean, this has been a very big story for what the past uh, over a week now. So you'll be hearing more about that this morning coming up on the Today Show. There are flooding concerns to our North and East. So plenty going on. Speaking of flooding, we'll be looking at the potential of showers and storms later today. First several hours of the day this morning, you're driving to work. It's going to be dry. You'll see sun, kind of a hazy sun. We expect some sunshine to spill over into the afternoon before we get into the chance of showers and storms. And as far as the threats, damaging winds, some hail and uh, like I said, some heavier rains and maybe some flooding tornadoes are definitely on the low end of the alert, but we can't ever rule that out completely. Right now it's quiet, so there is no rain or storms to worry about. Temperatures are in the 60s to near 70. And as we do get a look at the golfing forecast for today, you'll probably be able to get it in. But like I said, with the air quality the way it is, if you are one of those groups considered sensitive, being outside for that kind of time frame probably isn't the best idea today. Boating forecast, well, it's decent outside of the thunderstorm. So if you get a little boating in early, waves are one to three feet, but the winds and waves will be higher around any storm. So as we do some tracking on your National Design Mart forecast, we go from that hazy sun, and then by 2.30 this afternoon, especially south, we start to see showers, thunderstorms moving in, Mansfield through Worcester, approaching Canton, New Philadelphia, and then it's going to be really hit and miss, but we do see them close to the lake as well. I was talking about this just a few minutes ago. So from Sandusky over into Lorain County and Cuyahoga County, that's the view at 530 today. That's the view at 630. Commutes home from work and school could be impacted. There's the view at 730 tonight. Things starting to calm down a bit, but still looking at some heavy downpours. And as we get a check on your Union Home Mortgage 7 day outlook. Once these storms move out of the area this evening, we will be in for a beautiful Tuesday, Dave. Lots of sunshine, lower humidity. Fingers crossed that that air quality will be definite improvement for tomorrow. Wednesday looks great. The next good chance of rain comes at us later again on Thursday. All right, so get through today and we'll enjoy tomorrow. Yes. All right.